Hey everybody, I don't even know if I'm gonna actually upload this video, but um, the video quality on this is so bad. I went to go make a different video and it's not, it's not gonna work out. It's not gonna work out. So I'm gonna make this video instead and it's basically just like a book collection. Um, if I even post this, I don't know, but I'm gonna give it a go. So the first book I got, I got it for free. It's a children's book. It's, um, I know an old lady who swallowed a fly. It's by Mary Ann Hopperman and Nadine Bernard Westcott. And this is what it looks like. It's like one of those, like, hard covered books or uh, wooden books. Oh, it makes that nice crunchy sound. I don't know if you heard it. Anyways, the next book is um, by Neil Ga Gaiman. Um, it's the Coraline book, but it's the graphic novel. I love this book. I've read it. Um, a few times to be honest with you and I really don't like reading but I love it um this is like a heavier book this is the Grimm's Complete Fairy Tale the, by the Grimm's Brothers look how pretty it is oh you can't even see it because of the quality of this video but it's a very pretty book you'll just have to take my word for it I guess um some of these books I've owned for a couple years now so like I don't know the price so I'm really sorry about that um, The Stars Within You, A Modern Guide to Astrology by Julianne McGarthy, um, illustrated by Alondro Cardiz. Um, this is what it looks like. And I, it's not really like a reading book, it's more of like a kind of like a look through book. Um, and I remember when I got this book, I think about maybe four or three years ago, I was really obsessed with it. Since then, I really haven't picked it up. But I like reading through the signs so i'm really into anything like scary murder whatever so this book is the killer book the killer book of serial killers by tom philbin and michael philbin um this is what it looks like i think i got this off of i'm not actually sure to be honest with you but this is what it looks like um it's another one of those kind of just like flip through the pages types of books it's really nice well, not really nice because it's about murders, but it's a cool book to look through. Um, this is another book kind of like related to that. It's The Serial Killers and Mass Murderers, Profiles of the World's Most Barbaric Criminals by Nigel Cawthorn. Um, this is what the front looks like, and this is what the back looks like. It's this, It's really like the same thing as this book right here. I got them at the same time. Um... There's prices on the back, but that's not the price I paid for it, so I'm not even going to mention that. But this has a lot of, like, the known killers on there. Um, maybe not known to me, but known to... I'm sure people know all the killers in here. This is a cool book. Now, I used to be really into Five Nights at Freddy's. I still am, to be honest with you. So I have a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's books, but I don't really have, like, all of them. Um, actually, I'm missing a lot of them. <laughs> But this is the first one that I ever got. I remember I got this to read um, for 7th grade summer reading. And it's the Five Nights at Freddy's Silver Eyes. Um, and it's it's um not in the best condition since I've had it since 7th grade. And I'm now turning 21 in about 3 months. So it's, it's seen better days. But yeah, here's the back of it. Um, next is this book that I've had for about three years. I'm not even sure how I, uh, obtained this book, but it's more of a kid's book. It's called Hatchet by Gary Paulson. I remember reading it, and I don't really remember how I obtained it, but I remember really enjoying it. <laughs> not even gonna lie to you. Um, okay, so Five Nights at Freddy's, Freddy's Files. I have this one. I know there's three, but I think I only have two. I'm not really doing a lot of information on the FNAF books because everybody knows. This book I'm actually not going to show because it's from a local person in my town. And I live in a super small town, so no thank you. <laughs> um, I have the Five Nights at Freddy's survival vlog book. I've never used it, but I've had it for a few years now. Here, Yeah, here's the updated one. The updated edition of the Freddy Files. Like I said, I know there's a third one, but I never got it. Um, I have the graphic novel of the Silver Eyes. I want to get all the graphic novels. 
Um, I have the fourth closet and twisted ones. And I have the graphic novel for ew, 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 ew. the twisted ones. I do want to get the graphic novel for the fourth closet. And then I want to get the updated Freddy Files. And I think that's honestly all I'm going to collect. I know there's a bunch of other books, but I just, I'm not that into the story anymore to be collecting all those books. You know what I'm saying? Plus, I live on my own. Like, I, I can't afford all those damn books right now. But I do at least want to collect those two books, and then I'll say my collection is complete. But that was all of my books that I have. And um, if I do upload this, then you'll see. If I don't, then I just wasted six minutes. But I hope you all enjoy it. So bye, everybody.